are you ready to meet the next contender for powerhouse performance? Well, that's good, because here it is. The Surface Laptop Studio 2. Ooh, look. Hi everyone, my name's Hannah and I'm part of the Expert Zone UK and I team working with Microsoft. Today, I'm gonna to be going through a more detailed overview of some of the amazing features of the Surface Laptop Studio 2. If you just wanna take a look at what comes in the box, then why not check out our unboxing video linked in the description below. I have the device right here. So let's have a look at what we actually have in front of us. Firstly, everything I wanna watch, create or play looks pretty incredible. Thanks to the 14.4 inch PixelSense Flow display which supports a dynamic refresh rate of up to 120 hertz. It's a nice little in-between if you just can't decide between a smaller standard 13-inch or a larger 15-inch display that we see across other devices in the Surface range. The Laptop Studio 2 still has the core Surface display features that we know and love, such as the 3 by 2 aspect ratio, meaning you've got more screen real estate to play with, and the 10-point multi-touch screen so you can point, drag, draw with your finger or a pen. Not only do things look great on the screen, but now I can translate just how good I look right here, right onto this screen, thanks to the intuitive AI webcam features. From work to connecting with friends and family, video calls have become one of the essential tasks that defines the PC. With new Windows Studio camera and audio effects, you now have even more features to enhance your video experience. Make sure to keep the focus just on you with portrait blur backgrounds and automatic framing. Turn on voice focus to turn down the background noises like when your cat demands their process of hunger be heard right now. And you don't even need to look at the camera now to seem like you're paying attention thanks to the eye contact correction feature. No, this does not mean I'm giving you the excuse to fall asleep in your next Teams meeting because I guarantee you will get caught when your boss asks the next question. While we're still looking at the outside, let's take a tour of the ports. You have even more ports than you previously had on the Surface Laptop Studio. On the left-hand side, you still have the two Thunderbolt 4 USB-C ports that we know and love. And you also have the return of the USB-A port. Over on the right-hand side, you have a 3.5mm headphone jack, the Surface charging port, and now a brand new micro SD. It basically means that if you want to transfer files, you have three different methods without the need to find an adapter. Pretty sweet, if I do say so myself. I introduced this video with quite the bold claim that the Surface Laptop Studio 2 is a powerhouse when it comes to performance. But why? That might have something to do with the 13th generation H-series Intel i7 processor that delivers fast performance, perfect for doing everything at once. You can also multitask like a pro, thanks to the memory options of 16GB, 32GB or 64GB of RAM, and SSDs with either 512GB or 1TB of removable storage. What's even better is all options are built on the Intel Evo platform. This means that Intel have put this device through its paces against a checklist of criteria, such as battery life, boot up time, and what ports the device has to ensure that you're getting the premium laptop experience. Pretty great specs so far. Well, we haven't even got to the best part. My favorite thing about the Surface Laptop Studio 2 is one of the things that makes it stand out from the rest of the Surface family, the choice of graphic solution options. If you don't need to use apps for graphic design, gaming, or anything else, then you don't need a dedicated graphic solution. So go for the Intel Iris XE model instead. If you do need graphics for designing and creating on professional applications, then the NVIDIA RTX 2000 ADA generation laptop GPU will give you what you want. But if like me, you want a laptop that you can go between working, creating, and gaming on, Going for either the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4050 or 4060 GPU. With this, you can do it all. All right, I've kept you in suspense for long enough. We're finally gonna talk about it. The dynamic woven hinge. This unique hinge makes transitioning between a productive laptop, an angled stage mode, and an almost completely flat tablet almost seamless. New and innovative form factors always have that initial wow moment to make you go ooh and ah. 
But to really see the benefit of them, you kind of have to relate it to how you're actually gonna use it. For example, I tend to do a lot of my work in a traditional laptop mode because it feels most comfortable and I kind of need a keyboard. But as soon as I want some entertainment, I can get the perfect angle with stage mode. If I'm not gaming or watching something in this mode, I still have access to this touchscreen and this huge haptic touchpad. Lastly, I am a doodler and a note taker. So using the Slim Pen 2 while in tablet mode means it just feels loads more natural as it's not quite flat, so it sits at the perfect angle for me to create away. Speaking of writing, Christian, did you see where we put that Slim Pen 2? Only joking, it's been here the whole time. That's right, it magnetically attaches and charges right here under the lip of the keyboard. It also feels quite snazzy when I'm writing away as it gives haptic feedback, which feels like I'm actually writing with a pen on paper. So that's pretty much everything about this brand new powerhouse of a Surface device. It's built for performers, it's built to be immersive and to work exactly how you want to and to, to transform into what you want it to be. It's a device that looks and feels at the height of premium and is also an absolute beast when it comes to keeping up with your work or passions. Now, if I haven't answered all your questions about this new device, feel free to drop them in the comments below and we will be sure to come to your aid. But for now, all I need to do is figure out if anyone's gonna notice if I sneak this studio out of this studio for myself. Laters.